Here at BIC, we actually have two magnet programs. We have the Talent Development Magnet and the Waldorf Inspired Magnet. Shake, 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 shake. What will happen to the milk mixture when we put it in ice? The Talent Development Magnet bases its theories on Gardner's uh, multiple intelligences. First one, second one. He believes that all students learn by either mathematical, musical, verbal, visual, interpersonal, intrapersonal, naturalistic, or kinesthetic. What I like is it gives me an opportunity to be creative. I like to sing, dance, draw, and act, and I get to do these things at school. We infuse the arts into our curriculum. So we have fifth graders who have written a personal narrative to go with a clay tile project. It definitely helps them understand the subject matter more, and I think it definitely encourages reading. Um, a lot of people think, oh, they'll just color, they'll just do an art project, and that's it. But I think it encourages reading, and writing is so important to these kids. The presence of the magnet program has been like a magnet. It has really just sort of brought out of her all the things that are natural, her natural talents and skills and abilities. When I walk into this building and walk down the hall and see artwork that's uh, based off of uh, Van Gogh paintings or Matisse paintings or walk down and see students who have written poetry and it's all on the walls to display, I know that this is an environment that encourages children to succeed not just academically but emotionally, that it really puts their needs first. The coolest thing about Big is no matter what your talent is, there's pretty much something here for you to be able to do. The Waldorf Inspired Magnet is um, an emphasis on educating the whole child and bringing out the inner beauty and appreciating and valuing the student. Two eyes to see. Waldorf Inspired Learning is an attempt to educate the, the head, heart, and hands of the child to um, incorporate the entire body of the child, the entire spirit of the child in the learning process. We got butterflies, like we had larvae, we put them in this huge tent. We got to feed them, we got to watch them go in chrysalis, and we got to watch them, you know, larvae, pupa, butterfly. It was really cool. First day of storytelling, we simply tell the story without any gestures, without any, any pictures, let it, let it sleep so the child's imagination is totally engaged. Second day, we would retell the story and incorporate movement or drama. We took it further uh, and made it into individual books where the child actually retold the story entirely uh, in their own handwriting with their own illustrations uh, as they retold the story. I, I'm also able, this is also an assessment tool. I can see how much they're retaining of the story and how well they're able to retell it. We live in the Highlands and uh, when we were looking at schools, one of the biggest priorities was to consider a place where we could help expose our daughter to uh, a bigger world and so the Waldorf inspired magnet was important to us because we felt that they took that value and applied it academically, socially, behaviorally and so we felt that BIC you know, was the best opportunity to encourage and develop those skills. The Waldorf inspired program we would hope to create a student that's well-rounded um, respectful, knowledgeable, and has an appreciation for learning and for their environment. I hope that when our students leave this building that uh, by being able to provide them discover classes and letting them explore and to learn in ways that meets their needs, I hope that they will enjoy learning.